I, I got to say, if they do what Mel has the Jets projected to do, I think this is an incredibly impactful way to use these picks. He also has them trading back into the first round to take the top center in this year's draft, Tyler Linderbaum. Mm. Dan, if those three moves do, in fact, happen, what will that mean for Zach Wilson entering year two? Uh, well, first of all, that would be an absolute home run draft for the Jets, and everybody at this network would be ecstatic because they're all Jets fans. I know. Why, why um, do you have so many Jets fans? I, I think for, for Zach Wilson, it really would set him up as a second-year quarterback <laughs> to be in the best position for all the second-year quarterbacks. If we watched Zach Wilson last year, a lot of struggles early on, gets hurt. And then those last six games, post-injury, six touchdowns, one interception. Much more comfortable. So you're talking about a player that started to get a little bit better at the end of the season. And now if we look at the Jets as a football team, offensive line used to be a massive weakness. They got an up-and-coming star at left tackle in Becton. They've improved at right guard with Lakin Tomlinson. They got Elijah Veritucket at left guard that they drafted from USC last year. McGovern at center and Fant at right tackle. If you add a player like Thibodeau to that defense that's going to continue to play better team football, Drake London with size because his two, two is his top three receivers in Braxton Berrios and Elijah Moore are 5'8 and 5'9. Hmm. Mel is spot on. They need size. If they do that and then they get Linderbaum, who's a perfect scheme fit, under Mike LaFleur with the athleticism, Zach Wilson not only has the chance to be better in his second year, I honestly believe that Zach Wilson would have the chance to take off and take wow. a giant leap in his second season. Mm. Okay, Dan, I hear you. If they can get those three guys, Thibodeau, Linderbaum, and also get uh, Drake London, it would absolutely be a home run draft for them, but it doesn't quite make them a contender. Zach Wilson's play is what's going to make the Jets a contender. This isn't pro days with shorts and shirts on. These are grown men out there trying to take food off your plate and put it on theirs. So for Zach Wilson, he has to start eliminating the turnovers and play like a franchise quarterback if the Jets want to take that next step. Yes, you got Braxton Berrios, you got Elijah Moore, and you also got Corey Davis there. If you bring in Drake London, now you got two guys with size. So they have all these pieces, and if they get these three guys, that helps them in a tremendous way. But Zach Wilson's play is what's going to determine whether or not they get to the promised land or not. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.